right here, we have some of God's nectar. Snapple, okay? Now, if you are a longtime fan of this channel, or even a regular fan, or even if you've just seen one of my videos, chances are it was this video right here, um, you know, how to open a Snapple bottle, you know, always, always a classic, almost at 800 views by the time I'm recording this, you know, very, very nice video. Well, you can consider this a sequel slash spin-off to this video, or to that video, um, today we are going to be reviewing the Big Bottle Snapple. So right here we have some of the Big Bottle Snapple. Now, if you don't know, we are back with the Big Bottle Snapple. Look at that. Big Bottle Snapple. Is it bad? That amount of breath from just going up the stairs because that is not ideal. Here we are, big bottle Snapple. You know, this is 64 fluoride ounce, flu, flu, f ounces. The regular Snapple is 16, all right? So it's a lot more, it's four times more. Four, four little Snapples equals one big Snapple, right? It's a lot, right? Um, I totally haven't had all of this in a day, but uh, if anyone didn't ask, yes, I did. Um, anyways, so here we have a nice, uh, I'd say like 13 ounces, no, like 11. Um, and we're gonna review it. Now, the thing is, you might not believe this, but as I said in the last video, the packaging is a very large component of Snapple. For example, the stupid plastic bottles, they, um, the, the ones that are the same size as the glass ones, they are Satan's spawn, okay? You don't like those. Get that bullshit out of here, as I said the other day. Um, oh, also, I'm very sorry I didn't have a tuxedo to wear this time. You know what? We're gonna try, make it a little, a little bit, uh, on the formal side. <laughs> and we're gonna be wearing a Hawaiian shirt today. Um, it really depends on the, uh, the packaging, you know? Like, get this bullshit out of here. We don't like plastic Snapple. This one, on the other end, is good, because you, you're not gonna just have this out of the bottle, you know? That's, that's just weird. You don't want to be weird, do you? Um, you put it in a cup, right? So these ones are actually pretty good, especially in the summertime, you know? With some ice cubes, pop that big boy in there. Um, it's just gonna be so good especially after a long day you know maybe exercising and your mouth is all like dry like oh i need liquid in my body that's what she said you're just gonna be like hey what better to refresh your uh body and quench your thirst than an ice cold cup of snapple straight from the udders so here we are with the snapple um we're gonna try it out now because i think we've had enough context here um also, if you don't remember from the last video, I actually recommend watching the other video if you haven't seen this one. Um, a lot of Snapple, the, the taste depends on the texture, you know? A lot of creaminess is supposed to go in there. The, the thickness, you know, the, the, um, the girth of the Snapple. That is very important. So, um, these ones actually have extra, extra girth. Um, it just doesn't make up for quite as much when you have the glass. It's just a lot better on the glass. Like, that's obviously the, the high-level Snapple, you know, the, the cool people Snapple. Here's the glass, you know, the, uh, you know, the medium, I'd say. This is medium. And then the glass, all the, or not the glass, the plastic. All the way at the bottom where you can't even see it in hell, okay? Um, anyways, I think it's time to, uh, try this. You have to make that noise every single time you have snap, or else it's just not gonna sound good. If I'm being quite frank here, I I like it. I mean, it's pretty good, you know. I mean, it is Snapple, so of course I do. As I as you all know, I'm very much addicted to Snapple. But this in particular is a very very nice Snapple, I'd say. I'm gonna go ahead and enjoy this off camera after this video because 
Golly gee, I think I'm gonna cry. Anyways, on a scale of 1 to 10, I think I'd give it a 7.9. Unusual days, but this time it's more of like a 9.6. So, this. That is going to conclude this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think because I appreciate you in my life. I miss you. You know that? I really, I really do. It makes me kind of sad that you're not, not around anymore. Honestly, like, ever since, you know, you kind of just had to leave and it's really sad. You're just like, you know, wasn't good. But, um, you know, it's whatever, man. I mean, it makes me sad. You know, I gotta listen to Lucid Dreams now from Juice World. But, um, welcome back. We appreciate you here in the Gotham community, okay? I, w I aspire to be like Bob Ross one day. I don't know if I'll ever be able to reach that godly status, but you know what? A young man can try, okay? So, um, thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed, please leave a comment and a like down below. And, um, Happy painting, and I'll see you all in the next video.